Hello, this is Catherine from Accelerated Reader. Today, I will be reading Patterns in Rhyme, Patrick the Piglet's Learning Adventures, Book 2, by Belle Brown, illustrated by Gayatri Ray. Before I begin reading, I would like to give a big thanks to the author for sending me this book to read on my channel. In the description below, I have included links where you may find and purchase this book. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Patterns in Rhyme To my daughter, Isabella, who loves everything purple. Patrick the piglet is very curious. He learns new things each day. Today, he's looking for patterns as he hurries outside to play. A pattern is something that repeats. There are patterns all around, in nature and in things man-made. Many patterns can be found. Lots of colors, shapes, or numbers. Now you mix them up together. And if you can repeat it again, then you have made a pattern. So, Patrick the piglet goes on a quest. Some flowers he stops to smell. The paddles patterns are the same. And the colors are as well. Yellow, orange, yellow, orange, yellow. Just like a bowl of jello. Flower, insect. Flower, insect. Do you know what will come next? A ladybug sits on a flower and Patrick bends down to see. He sees black circles on its wings as it flies to a nearby tree. Her pattern, spots, are made of circles and usually there's quite a lot. Dalmatians, birds, giraffes, and fish. Can you name other animals with spots? Patrick sees a funny old badger. He has bold lines on his coat. His face has lines in black and white. From his ears, his nose, and down his throat. Black line, white line, black line, white line. Together, they make stripes. Tigers, bees, zebras, and snakes. Do you know other animals with stripes? Patrick trots towards the stream and notices a pool. He drops a pebble in the water. He finds ripple patterns cool. Patrick roams further from the farm. He strolls down to the beach. The waves go to and fro on the shore. A nice pattern they repeat. The piglet then picks up a shell. It has the pattern of a spiral. Because it's such a lovely thing, Patrick carries it a while. Before the sun begins to set, he returns home to his sty. Farmer John wears a checkered shirt, another pattern he spies. Now everywhere that Patrick looks, he sees patterns standing out. I found another one, he exclaims. With a jig, a jog, and a happy shout. The end. Thank you for listening. Don't forget to like and subscribe. In the description below, I've included links where you may find and purchase this book.